PAUSE stands for Preventing Accidents with Safety. It's a program that was created by students at Michigan Tech years ago to incorporate safety in the unit operations lab. It's kind of a proactive approach to having a safety culture. Having that hands-on experience is always something that stays with you longer than just reading something. So, I mean, in industry, safety is a, a very important metric. It doesn't matter which company you work for. You can't really get that anywhere else. Rather than just a sign on the wall that says, wear your safety glasses, it's ingrained into people. It's a habit, like everyone does it. They bring it up to the forefront rather than just like putting the poster on the wall that says, hard hats required after this point. It's rules that are supposed to help you figure out when you're in a setting where there's dangers all around you, what you should do so that you're not um, putting yourself or others in danger. Rather than just thinking about safety as a afterthought, it's more of a proactive approach, like a safety culture in the department. It actually engages you in terms of thinking critically about what you're doing, um, coming up with ideas to improve safety further. They introduced us to the PAUSE form, really to learn about safety while performing chemical engineering. I think what makes PAUSE unique is that it's student run. The students run the meetings, the students hold each other accountable, um, the students are the ones filling out the PAUSE forms. All the sections get together and we hold a big safety meeting where we go over anything that came up or needs to be reiterated or something that came up from a PAUSE form that someone filled out. It is always the first and, and the top priority uh, activity for any industrial facility and it is a cultural thing that just is ingrained in the people that work for these companies. You know you'll be coming out safe because everybody is watching out for you. I think it's a good way to prepare yourself for after graduation, no matter if you end up in industry or end up at a university somewhere. And so if students are, are in tune with that, and if they're aware of that, when they move through the, the instruction in the undergrad program and then they get out into industry, this will already be a, a part of their DNA, a part of their thought process, and perhaps even a part of the way that they conduct their own, their own personal lives as well as their lives when they're working for a company uh, in the business. Outside of the classroom, things you learn in the PAUSE program are handy because you really think about it more often. If you're using power tools, you might more instinctively just put your safety glasses on. And I think that's really a good thing to carry over too because in industry, safety is really a priority. So it's good to get students used to that. Through the experience here, you can actually look back and be like, okay, I know what kind of safety concerns to look for. I kind of understand more of how to create a safe culture and so you can contribute in the industry as well. This safety culture that's being built by the PAUSE program is something that will definitely be seen everywhere. It never ceases to amaze me that every time I come back on campus, every time I tour through the lab, it looks like there's an extra level of refinement on, on just the overall safety program, the safety awareness. And I know a lot of that is driven through the, through the PAUSE program. It is a really important thing to impart to students and uh, it will much better equip them to, to become an active and contributing member of any company that they go work for. So I think it's a great, uh, a great program, it's a great philosophy, and it's a great practice. It will serve students well.